hello guys we are back with another video and in this video i'm going to give you a tutorial a small uh, a description about this calculator this scientific calculator in this video i'll just show you what this calculator can do i'm just give you a small explanation about all these its functions and all okay so it's a scientific calculator uh, Casio company and its model number is FX991MS so here it is you can see there uh, in all normal general calculator you can see all these functions but in this it's scientific calculator so it has some more function because it can perform uh, sorry I forgot to tell you about it it this calculator can perform 401 function okay so um let's just switch it on uh one second okay so this calculator is all there are some keys you can see some extra key these are some extra keys sine cosine tan in g m plus or it's raised to power so i'm gonna tell you about all this about all this so uh as it's a scientific calculator it can perform all its scientific calculation like if you want to find out the value of any sine cos tan or the inverse of the value it can give you the answer or if you want to find out the value of sine cos or tan in some other units like in gradient or radian other than degree with the answer if you, want to, if you want to find out the integration it can do it if you want to find out the differentiation it can do it if you want to find out the root it can do it if you find out the cube root it can do it if you want to find out square of function if you find out the if you want find out the degree of uh, I mean a um, value of any degree it will find out the value so here it all function and all okay so and it can also find out the log and anti log and the main its function is there's a some normal and basic function of this calculator but if yeah, you can see this button mode if you press this you'll see some functions so this one is if you just stuck some somewhere in the calculator like uh, you want to come in the normal mode so you just press the mode just press the mode and press 1 you will come in this normal condition of this normal situation normal ok so for this for normal like this if you want to uh, solve uh, if you want to find out or if you want to solve some complex equation with you know, iota so you will press 2 and you can solve all those equations so next is you can see if you press this mode second time then you'll see this okay so sd is for standard deviation rg is for regression and base is like uh, if you want to find out or solve any equation with any base you'll press modes two times then you'll press three you want to find out the regressions coefficient or line of regression you'll press mode two times and uh, you will press 2 if you want to find out uh, the you will you know equation related to standard deviation or question related to standard deviation you will press mode 2 times and then you will press 1 so I am pressing it again it means I am I have pressed the mode button 3 times so if you press the mode button 3 times you will see this ok so if you want to find out the equation equation with any degree and uh, like uh, two unknown values or three unknown values you'll you press this mode this mode button three times and then press one two unknowns or three unknowns or two degree or three degree so three times then you get this so if you want to find out the matrix questions find out the value of matrix or like calculation or a multiplication or something like that you can just press just uh, press this button three times and then press two 
I'll give all the tutorial of this mode functions in the next video. So in this video, I'm just showing you how you I just work. Um, so this matrix third is for vector function. We need to find out uh, equation related to vectors. Just press mode button three times and then press three. Next, uh, I've told you in the in the starting of the video that if you want to find out the value of sine, cos, or tan, or inverse of the sine, cos, or tan in any units, this can do it. If you want to find out the value of sine in degree, like one degree, two degree, just press mode four times and then press one, and all the values will put in the in the like angle the sine cos or tan so it will be in degree if you want to find out the in the angle in radian just press mode four times and then press two so all the angles or units will be in radian so if you want to find out the value of sine cos or tan but the angle should be in radian then press mode button three uh, four times then press three so all the angles the units of the angle will be in gradient so the answer will be you will get uh, will be in gradient okay so i'm pressing it again this is for fixed sign a normal uh, like this is for we want to get the value in decimals or in exponential form so you can choose this method just this mode function okay i'll show you in the next video uh, the next is just for uh, if you want to change the brightness or contrast of this screen you can adjust it no sorry just press 2 light dark light you can see this bright the screen just become bright also oh, light so if you want to dark it just press the right side you can see this it's showing you arrow for dark and for left for light so I'm just keeping it how this I want okay so that's all for this video thanks for watching guys if you like the video give it a thumbs up